Hello, I'm Dr. Lisa Lillianfield from Kaplan Center for Integrative Medicine. This is the third in the series on the yamas and niyamas, the first two limbs of the eight limb path of yoga. The third yama is called asteya, non-stealing. This seems quite obvious, thou shalt not steal, but there are subtle ways that we steal from others and from ourselves. How often do we rush from one thing to the next without thought to the present moment? We are stealing from ourselves by crowding our day with too much, being late and not being present. We will never get this moment back or this moment. By slowing down, allowing ample time to get where we need to go, by staying present in the moment, we are practicing asteya. How do we steal from others? When instead of truly listening, we are only thinking of the next thing to say, how our story is better, we are stealing that moment. Again, by being present with others as they communicate, we are practicing asteya. There is a form of stealing that has become acceptable in our society, and that is downloading illegal music and movies. We are so removed from the artist and writer that we don't feel like we are stealing. Practicing asteya, we take pause and become aware that someone has worked hard and put their skills and talent into creating something that should be compensated for. While we may not steal in the material sense from someone, by coveting what others have, we are stealing. By realizing we have enough, we have just what we need, we are practicing asteya. The Japanese concept of wabi-sabi is the concept of realizing the beauty of something with all its imperfections and, imp and impermanence. And with that, we can appreciate that we are unique and beautiful. We don't need to have more be something we are not. We are perfect in our imperfections. The Buddha said, be where you are, otherwise you will miss most of your life. By practicing asteya, we slow down, appreciate this moment, ourselves and others, and realize the abundance in which we live. Can you think of ways that you may steal from yourself or others by not being present? Next time, we will discuss the fourth yama, brahmacharya, non-excess. Namaste.